Apple and its supplier Broadcom have been ordered to pay more than a billion dollars for patent infringement. California Institute of Technology sued those two companies for infringing four of their patents. The patents are related to Wi-Fi chips used in Apple's iPhones and other devices. The lawsuit suit mainly targeted Broadcom, but Apple was also named as one of Broadcom's biggest customers. Both companies plan to appeal the verdict. Nike is being investigated by the U.S. securities watchdog. There are allegations that the sportswear giant was bribing elite youth basketball players. Now, according to Bloomberg, the probe was announced at the extortion trial of celebrity lawyer Michael Avenatti. Mr. Avenatti allegedly threatened to financially damage Nike by going public with evidence of its bribery unless he received a payoff to the tune of $25 million. Mr. Avenatti and Nike have denied any wrongdoing. Consumer goods giant Unilever reports 2019 fourth quarter sales were up 1.5 percent. That's slightly better than market expectations of 1.4 percent. But it's the company's slowest quarterly underlying sales growth since 2009 as it sees stuttering growth in India and China, two of its biggest emerging markets, as well as increasing competition in North America and Europe. The company says the impact of the coronavirus outbreak in China on its business remains unknown. China contributes 5% to Unilever's total sales.